Hello guys and welcome back to Bedlam. Now we're going to go and explore another area in here and I think we'll have to start slowly rushing to Aztec City. I explored enough and I don't think there is much point in doing much more. I just need some oil and we'll be moving on. Stop and investigate, yes we're going to do that. I'm going to approach the driver, okay greetings, blah blah blah. And we're going to accept whatever offer he has. We're going to change meat for crude, change crude for meat, change power cells for crude. That sounds like a decent idea, let's go and do that. Okay, we wasted 5, we got 240 oil, so that's not bad, I'm happy with that arrangement. Let's go and keep rolling out of here, I really need to get out. We're on the really high levels here, stop and investigate again. Okay, the nomad is approaching us, invite the mutant nomads to enter the other. We can attack them or invite them or leave. I'm going to leave, I'm not going to be taking any of them. I want to keep moving. I just want to really get to the Aztec city and unlock new nations here. So hopefully you can speed run through this city. Let's go, stop and investigate again. Okay, graph the horrors below in innovations. Great. I'm going to ask this guy why he's here and check what he has to say. Okay, so he wants to borrow some batteries from us. We can accept or decline. I don't really particularly care. I will accept that, I think, because I really want him. Hopefully he will join us as well. So the surgeon steps inside the vehicle. You hear the sound of fusion power tools and unsettling moist sound. Okay. Surgeon steps forward with another man who has been augmented with a number of cybernetic pieces. Great. Okay, we can invite him to our daughter. And that's what we're going to do. And this guy will join our crew now, so that at least we are here better protected. We lost some power cells, but that's okay. Let's check our crew. We really need people, so that's okay. Guy who joined us was here, I think. No, that's Beef. Where is the guy who joined us? Well, he doesn't appear to be anywhere. So I said he joined us, but he never actually did properly. Oh well, never mind. Okay, here is the oil city that I would like to get to ready. I'm sure if I can get there on time. Hopefully I can. So let's try to skip it and let's just run through it. Tower of Metallic Debris appears in front of us. That's great. I'm going to be fighting with cyborgs. Okay, first fight. That's fine. I have to pick up a team. I don't think I need anything that much because I want to rush it. So I just throw beef as well. I will just go and kill them. Probably that makes the most sense. Be aware of Blitz Emitter. Yes, be very aware of this. This is deadly. And what changes to the game, they change it a little bit how it works. Not sure if it works here, I have to update it, but now it gives them one extra turn. Okay, let's see what we can do in here. Two moves and then we can shoot. I move beef. Anywhere, she can't really do any damage. Can any of them guys actually shoot if they move? Probably not. So I will just move here and wait for them to make their moves. That's fine. It's perfectly okay. Now. B, if you move forward, mate, and you're going to destroy them. Send my crew forward as well, because I really need them kind of ahead. So we can start shooting very closely, very shortly. Oh, perfect beef. You can shoot, or beef can do it. Can you shoot? No. Only beef can do it then, that's fine. Go beef. Go beef. Go, 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 go. Perfect. That's what I wanted to see. Can I kill anyone else? Not from this position. Well, that's okay, I can send my team forward at least. So they got... Ah! Didn't expect you to get hit. Okay, Beef, you have to go out of your way there. And we'll have to send them dudes forward and just wait. 
Okay, so AI is not the smartest one. They sometimes make stupid mistakes like that. So a shotgun here and would do four damage. Possibly makes sense to do it. Let's go for it. Perfect. Okay, I see we're running on the old blitzometer still. But it doesn't reset. In the new game, the blitzometer will reset when people die, so that's not too bad. Okay, let's move forward and kill somebody else again. If I go here, I can actually kill them. So maybe I should do it. Just run there and kill him. Perfect. So far, so good. The problem is when the Blitzometer actually starts working next turn, we are really in a bad shape. So we have to kill these people as quickly as possible and then hide. Level up. Perfect. How much damage do I do? I do 8 damage. Should be able to kill this guy then. That will work. And let's hide as far as we can. And the blitz round, which means basically that somebody will die 100% of the time in this old update. The new update will be a little bit different. Second damage, perfect. And we leveled up as well, so it's not too bad. But really the old system was not the best. I was not impressed with it. Ah, That's a shame. It's fine though, we can kill this dude though. And we should be fine. There is one more, I didn't notice him. That's okay though. Because we can kill him as well. And we leveled up as well, perfect. Pick up some meat, some batteries and some oil. And we'll keep going. Okay. Let's stop and investigate. Let's take some meat. Okay, we're being immediately attacked, that's kind of expected. Send my guys back. Bring the crew of heavy hitters with their hands. And that's how we're going to run it. Let's hope for the best here. There's a lot of them. Well, that's kind of problematic really, but hopefully we can pull this through. Let's send people just into some sort of cover. Okay, we'll go like that. We'll wait for them to move. See if they do anything. Not bad. I can go here and start shooting. That's the option. He does 6 damage though. That's a lot of damage to be done. Wouldn't necessarily want to fight him. So maybe... I'll just move people forward a little bit there. And hopefully we'll be ready for anything they can pull. Okay, we have to start working because the blissometer is working and that's just silly. Let's run in and shoot. Perfect. Oh, that's nice. That's fine. Now, I prefer that scenario than anything else. Because now I can just hide somewhere. I can pick up the battery and he can go forward. That's fine. Okay, what can we do? I can shoot. And we're going to. I can attack here for 2 damage. Or I can shoot for better damage. We're going for that then. Ah! Dead eye got us. We're going to attack. And we should be fine. That's okay. This guy will come here. I can shoot him with a shotgun, so that's fine. 
but we really need to start thinking what to use in here. I have no equalizers and the blitz round is coming, so let's send everybody out as far away as possible just so they can survive the blitz round, which they won't because that's how blitz works at the moment. So let's see. Yeah. You see? Uh, that was how this, how stupid the system was. Uh, I don't think we're going to win this fight. Not impressed with it. Can't even use weapons. Let's just run in a short close distance there. And we're going to die. So yeah. We completely lost the fight in here, we have one extra guy, let's pull him in, let's attack. There's nothing else I can do really. The Blitzometer just basically destroys your army. It's so much does really ruin it. Let's go and attack, perfect. Yeah, one extra shot and we're dead. And luckily not. And now it's finished. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of lost that, but we are still working apparently. Let's go. Okay. We lost, unfortunately, guys. Sorry for that. But what I'm going to do, I'm going to play on my own. I'm going to unlock uh, different nation and then we'll play on different nation for now thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed it as always and see you guys next time hi guys just a quick message to say thank you for watching this video i would really appreciate if you gave it a like because that really helps me a lot and helps other people to find it please drop me a comment if you are interested in chatting to me and you can also follow me on twitter and facebook or join me on my patreon website as well and if you are new to the channel please do subscribe because that will help you to stay up to date with all the videos that i'm making daily on the channel for you guys thank you guys for watching again and please stay awesome and i will see you guys next time